What is good, everybody? This is your boy DB Kicks, and we are back with another video, another sneaker. I almost said a sneaker banger, but an outfit video planned for today. Man, it's June 1st, and we're already banging out these summer outfits, man. We're getting them ready. That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm going to bring to you guys today. So if you enjoy this video, please smash that like button. Subscribe if you feel like subscribing, all that good stuff, man. I did review this New Balance 550 in the multicolor. I uh, reviewed it about two weeks ago, so for the guys that haven't seen it, if you're watching this video, here it is, um, and I'm going to just bring you guys some slight, as I like to call it, so what I mean when DB says slight outfit inspiration, man, this is inspiration, I'm not telling you guys, hey, go get this shirt, go get that shirt and wear it with this, I'm kind of showing you guys what I'm comfortable with wearing, how I personally would like to style it, and if you guys choose to go choose to go get something similar to it, a hat that I might link, or a t-shirt that I have on. I'm cool with that too. I've I've um I've had plenty of people comment and say, hey, I'm gonna go order this or that. That's that's cool. I'm cool with that. But you don't have to like the outfits. You know, I'm just sharing it with y'all. Um you don't have to love it. That's cool. That's why I call it slight outfit inspiration. Alright. So let's get straight into the slight slight outfit inspiration man so first outfit of the day man so i always like to do something that is kind of i call i like to call it like having fun uh, i don't really know how to say it but it's kind of like something kind of careless really comfortable just whatever for example like i did a uh i styled a crash bandicoot t-shirt with a new balance and the outfit went crazy. I actually won outfit grid off of that. But anyway, so as I'm wearing right now, I'm actually wearing this one in the video. You guys can see I am rocking a Carhartt cap. Now I did get this from Carhartt's website. My wife ordered it, so I don't know prices or anything like that. I'm rocking a Dare long sleeve t-shirt. Dare, man, who remembers Dare? And it says, you know, keeping drugs, keeping kids off drugs, you know, the Dare program. If you guys remember that, uh that kind of tells something about your age and it is a long sleeve so don't look at me crazy it's a very lightweight long sleeve t-shirt that's why you can see me rocking it with a pair of fear of god essentials sweat shorts now you guys know man i'm always gonna find a way to slip some fear of god essentials in my outfit videos even though i ain't really been rocking with essentials as of lately but you guys see it this is a dare long sleeve t-shirt cool dope t-shirt in my opinion $7.99 you can't beat it I'm gonna let you guys in on a quick secret a lot of little graphic tees that I'll pick up that just go dope with shoes come from Marshalls um, the crash one I just talked to you guys about that was eight dollars this dare shirt that I'm rocking right now is eight dollars you pair it with a fire sneaker you pair it with uh, a dope pair of shorts if you want to go essentials or maybe Nike or uh, well not Nike in this case if you want to do something like that that kind of like gives it more of a mature look, you know what I mean? And this is something like, clearly I'm just chilling. Like I'm not really matching too much. Like I don't really care. The shirt's orange. The shoe isn't orange at all, but it just looks really well together because the, letter, the lettering is yellow. If you look closely on the Dare shirt, the D-A-R-E is actually like a cream with a black outline. So I just wanted to just put that together, man. And I think the multicolor look of the New Balance, it just goes really well with orange. All right, next outfit I have here, we're gonna switch back to all short sleeves, man. So this is a New Balance embroidered t-shirt that I picked up from In Clothing. This is the one I had to wait a little bit to get, but it's like a um the same mustard yellow that you see on the New Balance 550. And it's got black stitching and kind of like a rose gold uh, stitch lettering that says New Balance. Very dope. Never owned a New Balance t-shirt before. So I think this is pretty fire. It's like that golden yellow. And these shorts. Let's talk about these shorts, man. So these shorts, I picked these up at Marshalls as well. These were like 29 bucks. These are Ralph Lauren. Truth be told, it's a swimming trunk. But it's like not really a swimming trunk. Like it does have the lining, but... Bro, like you see these shorts, you're gonna be like, oh yeah, I can rock this with this, you know. If you wanna rock these to the beach or something like that, cool. If you wanna rock them to the mall, bro, nobody's gonna know. If you wanna go as far as cutting the inside netting, you can't tell me this shoe was not made for these Ralph Lauren shorts. 
Actually, let me grab them real quick. They don't even look like swimming trunks. They look like Nike woven shorts, that same style. And I love how the drawstrings, let me get real close up real quick. I like how the drawstrings are cream, but they're like a thick rope lace with metal tips. These retailed from Ralph Lauren, these are $80 shorts, man. $80 shorts, but that's just crazy, bro. But yeah, it says like Jamaica on it and the colors is just, the graphics, the colors, it's just crazy. And you still got that polo horse at the bottom left leg. So you guys see I'm rocking a red and white Supreme five panel cap. I love my Supreme caps, man, because I can pretty much buy any color for any outfit that I want to wear and I'm good to go. Some of them are a little bit weird, but I tend to go with the, the basic five panel and I keep it at that. So this New Balance t-shirt retail, I believe like $38 or 30 bucks. I got it on sale. Uh, the shorts I picked up for $29 from Marshalls and you guys already know about the sneaker. Let's get to the last and final look. This one's a little bit more formal, a little bit more dressy. And this is like something like if I'm a hit, if I want to go out for the night or something like that, I want to hit the bars up for you guys. It's 21 and up. Me and the wife want to go somewhere. I'm kicking it with the homies. This is something that I'm going to wear out of these three outfits. So this here, you guys can see, man, I'm rocking a pair of navy blue shorts. So I actually got these from American Eagle a long time ago, and I'm just popping the tags for this video. But they're like a navy blue, just pair of shorts. Very clean, in my opinion. I have khaki as well, or I may not have khaki, I don't know. <laughs> but navy blue shorts, of course, I had to go with a J. Crew t-shirt. I cannot remember exactly what kind of J. Crew shirt this is, but it's in one of my old videos. If I find it, I'll make sure I link it. But a very high quality t-shirt. It's, it's gray, but it's got like a marble look to it. Really dope. And I chose gray because New Balance 550 has like a slight hit of gray in it on the collar. So I kind of like to play off of the, the minimal colors. And you guys see I'm rocking a J. Crew flannel as well. Now, keep in mind, it is summertime, but these flannels aren't heavyweight flannels and neither was the Dare t-shirt. Very lightweight flannel. And truth be told, guys, if you get too hot and you're wearing something like that, you can just take the flannel off and you still got on a really dope undershirt. And I went with a navy blue Fear of God fitted cap because currently those are my favorite fitted caps and I cannot get my hands on any other ones because fitted caps are selling extremely fast nowadays. But yeah, in my opinion, this is a look, man. I switched the watch up, went with a Movado watch, all that stuff. I got a tiny ass wrist, so <laughs> this watch is a little big on me and those are the three outfits man so you guys comment down below let me know what was your favorite outfit or if you weren't wasn't feeling any of those outfits that is cool too but i just wanted to give you guys some slight outfit inspiration for this 550 because this shoe i've said it over and over is definitely an essential for the summer i think this is just really this is one that I think everybody should have as a 550. And it's just, it's a low, it looks very classic. You really can just do a lot with this shoe. The only thing that I kind of don't like about this shoe is the toe is tight, which makes you not want to go down in size, but the midfoot is wider. So you do get a little bit of heel slippage when you're wearing a pair of these. Other than that, that's really it. So all these outfits are fire in my opinion. So you guys let me know what was your favorite outfit, if any, was your favorite. Did you guys pick up a New Balance 550 at all in your collection? I appreciate everybody coming through. Showing love to the channel, man. Everybody sharing the videos, everybody liking, commenting, subscribing, unsubscribing. It doesn't matter. I appreciate the traffic, man. We are growing faster than ever at this moment. Like, I can't even keep up. I must be doing something right because uh, the content right now guys it's booming and it seems like you guys that actually do watch um you guys really love these like outfit style videos man so i'm gonna try to keep them coming don't quote me on it i'm gonna try to put out at least one outfit video a month for a shoe that recently came out we'll see or i might take it back you know what i'm saying to something old we'll see but again thank you guys for watching man greatly appreciate it we're working grinding every single day you guys stay safe out there. You guys stay blessed, man. Crazy world we living in, man. Y'all, for real. Y'all stay 
safe out there. And your boy DB Kicks is out.